The Clean Foundation has presented its findings of its gender audit report on protection services, shelters and safe homes for survivors of human trafficking. The acting executive director of Clean Foundation is Ruth Orloffing. During the presentation, she said the project seeks to support and strengthen the gender responsiveness of interventions, particularly interventions by the National Agency for the Prohibition of Trafficking in Persons, NAPTIP, and other relevant government agencies. She added that the data also contains key information on safe homes and shelters for victims of trafficking in the FCT and that the findings provide gaps with empirical evidence and provide stakeholders areas of opportunity for interventions in relation to gender-specific programming. We want to prevent trafficking of women and girls in Nigeria and also to engender a policy, um, a gender policy environment um, in the country around the issues of human trafficking, forced migration of women and girls. When you talk about shelters, they are heavily concentrated within the AMAC area. Uh, so what it means is that places like Abaji, Kuali and all of that, you have less shelters that cater to the needs of um, survivors of human trafficking and forced migration. There's also the issue of gender disaggregated data. So people just come in and they are just documented. You know, um, you don't have that consciousness to say, okay, um, how many men are coming in? How many women are, are coming in? The report is a long um, overdue one because the issue of gender is one that is actually being mainstreamed globally. And for us in the agency, it's a laudable development and we're happy about it. It's one that will help every safe house and caregiver to know that gender cases are supposed to be treated. All we want to know is that what are the protective aspects for victims of human trafficking and forced migrants. We know that when people are, when, go, when they go through issues, they become traumatized. So what are those things you have to do? And if they are not available, what are the things you do, like referral? So it's good that NAPTIP is here and you and women sponsoring this uh, kind of a audit report. I think one of the things we are proud of is the inclusiveness in everything. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.